Okay, this could be a little shocking for most people to think they understand chemistry and physics, but hydrogen, they claim, is one proton, helium is two, lithium three, beryllium four, carbon is six, oxygen eight, so they go by that as their atomic mass, and it's nothing even close to that. Those are just the number they are really in the periodic chart. They, here's the deal, look at this. This is lithium. Lithium is right here. All right, it's supposed to be three. Well, guess what? Three is a stable state, yes. Three is in, and in that range right in between there, they are pretty stable and they don't fall apart, have half-lives. But look at this, these are the half-lives of all the other sizes of lithium. This is a bazillion different lithiums and these are the weights. The atomic weight is how much they weigh, <laughs> all right, There's the, the, which is the mass of them. So they're all different weights, and how can they be all different weights? It's because some of them are missing a few of these, or some of them have a few extra. But they really want to be, let's say, right here. They want to be right there. That's where they're stable. Stable state, stable state right there. Well, you know, you could be a stable even with two or three less, because you can see they're not the same exact weight. Alright, so these go, you lose a couple of electrons, you're still pretty stable. Now, when you get way up and you have a ton of extra electrons, shoot, somebody else is going to want them, they leave. So your half-life, you keep breaking down until you end up getting stable, or you keep adding more until you come up to stability. That's all it is, is the excess of electrons. So this is nothing like one big proton, and there's like three of them make up this whole thing. Absolutely not. It's impossible. Absolutely impossible. Even hydrogen. There's a zillion hydrogens. Helium, same thing. Well, here, here's helium. Look. These are all the different helium. It's supposed to be a noble gas and only have two. Look at this. This is the stable states. Again, you have some that are, aren't quite full of electrons and you have some that have too many electrons. They want to get down to stability. Alright, we gotta take a whole new look at the periodic chart, my friends.